Hey gearheads, how many times has this happened to you guys? Um, how many times have you gone to uh, grease your lower bearing on your um, Kingpin Dana 60 only to find your uh, um, Zerk fitting that was there is sheared off, guys? Uh, that's frustrating. I read a pretty good tech article on Pirate 4x4, um, Villa Vista, Dana 60 build. Um, they had an idea on there, guys. Um, I'm going to put it to video. I really like it. So let's go in. Let's go with it, guys. Okay, we've got a sheared Zerk fitting on our uh, lower kingpin bearing, Dana 60. Now I don't carry. I don't normally carry a um, easy out that small, guys. That would get lost. But I do carry a bit set. I know most of you gearheads and rockers um, do carry a bit set, and most of them have a square drive uh, section in them. This is a number two square drive, square head. That actually fits in that Zerk fitting. Uh, you can pound it in with your BFH. You know, pound it in so you get good engagement with your uh, square drive. Then you can, if you got a quarter inch, uh, you know, quarter inch drive, or you can use a uh, small crescent, or you can use vice grips, whatever, um, back that old Zerk fitting out. You can see that that uh, square drive penetrated it real nice and hooked, hooked it up good. So um, I like that, guys, because um, I don't have the uh, easy outs with me. Okay, on the Villa Vista site, um, Pirate 4x4, they put a shroud around their uh, um, Zerk fitting. So let's, let's go with that, guys, and try that. Let's wind the new Zerk fitting in. If I can get it started square, maybe. Little teeny shit. These old eyes are getting older. Okay, let's wind that in. Okay, we've got that snugged in. Now, I made this ring out of uh, three quarter inch pipe. Uh, this is stainless steel. I just happen to have it laying around. Cut it on the lathe. Anyway, we're gonna set that over the Zerk fitting and then run a weld bead around this, guys. Um, I've already got one built here. We'll put that on. Set that on. Anyway, you can see um, pretty good shrouding around that Zerk fitting. Wish this camera, this old phone would focus a little better. Anyway, um, it sits below the, uh, about an eighth inch below the level of the, the ring. Um, pretty solid, you can get your grease gun in there nicely. I don't think there's any rock in hell that's gonna come up and contact that, so. Um, Thank you guys on Pirate 4x4, all you rockers. Um, very good suggestion, I'm going with it. So, uh, as soon as I get my axle back, we're having a ring and pinion put in it, installed in an ARB. Then we're gonna um, go ahead, we're gonna put uh, reed racing knuckles on it, um, 35 spline axles, beef it up a little bit, guys. So, anyway, Dodge M37 build. It'll be done one of these days. Just waiting, waiting on parts and people. Later, gearheads. Bye, guys. Oh, God.